Gotta get back to Sindri's and figure out how to save Father. And I gotta keep Ironwood and Angravota a secret somehow. What'd I get myself into? Better get back to Sindri's before anyone notices. I wanted to visit Fenrir. For two days. I... Do not lie to me again! Why did you come here? Alone? Do you seek death? No more than you. Then why? Why? What is it you will not tell me? I have tried to walk this path with you. We follow your every whim. But you don't believe in any of it. And still, I follow. Because all that matters is that you are safe. But that's not all that matters. Who's keeping you safe? I do not need you to protect me. You sure about that? What do you know? I can't talk about it. But I just need you to trust me. You kept secrets, but I trust you. That's not the same. Why not? You hid things. Mother hid things. You had good reasons, and so do I. Why can't you just... Mother, get up! 
missed a boot, is she? No. Father, are you okay? Focus on the enemy, not me. Yes, sir. <laughs> 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 That was blood. Ah. Yeah. Poison! Don't laugh it! Why won't you say anything? Violation imaginable. No! You do not want this. Call your mind. Control it. She was our friend. Maybe, for the moment, you're of more use to me. A pleasure to see you again. Rodnifer. Do not let him out of your sight. You heard him, sunshine. Come on, get a move on. Refuse to remain bound to this realm. We travel to Vanaheim. Well, guess it's just us then. <sighs> One gateway to Vanaheim coming right up. If you are still bound, how... Travel. I crafted a protection ward that'll keep me from being pulled out of the realm. It should hold until I find what I need. And what is that? The source of the magic that binds me to Midgard. We're going to find it. And destroy it. 
I will help you. But it will not change what I have done. I know. That's why I still might kill you when this is over. We going or what? Ain't going nowhere without this. Sure. Where would you muck spouts even be without me? And what is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly, you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddess way of asking for help? I don't recall asking you to come along. Because you did? I got to bring you to the other once this joint were back on the map. Got a hunch something you folks a hand is gonna end me up where I'm going. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard, Carol, she was running with that beat brother. Is not a part of this. Well, my hunch says other. Scrow too. I can feel the pool of the binding curse. Its source is further in. Follow me. Muggier than a Moonfallheim shit pit out here. And nearly as fragrant. Suppose Thimble Winter's to blame. But if it helps these two find peace... <laughs> this is a temporary alliance. Anything beyond that would require trust. Oh, please. You know damn well Kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering. You're both as much a part of my suffering as anyone. Come on, let's find a way forward. Mm, that's gonna need more magic than we got, Sonus. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Pimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. Seems I don't. Falcon! <sighs> Come on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. Hey, uh, how's about a rip in the mind? What oh. runs with no legs? Easy, a nose. You'll have to try harder than that, bro. Just you wait, smart guy. Watch where you're going. The plants are extra aggressive in this humidity. <laughs> Recognize this market. Villages would meet and trade here. Why'd they never be found? Now what we got here? Oh! Ah! 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 
Now don't that get the old Where is everyone gone, I wonder? They must have withdrawn. Hidden themselves out in the wilds and covered oh. their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran cockshot all over this place, huh? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again as soon as I was exiled? Like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it. So you just refuse to pick a favorite poem? That's uncharacteristically indecisive of you. I have a favorite poem already. One from my homeland. <laughs> Why do you keep bringing him up? My brother is no concern of yours. Do you understand? 
Oh, I understand plenty. Life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it, dwarf. Listen, I know how bad it can get with one stone again. Sentry and I were on the out so long it was like not having a brother at all. Now nah, I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking. Out. But it never stopped me blaming him most. Sound familiar so far? And what is your point? My point is, that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time had passed. He went straight back to being as big a pain in my ass as he ever was. family, you gotta keep them close. It makes me good and crazy. Why do you think I need to hear any of this right now? My focus is on regaining my freedom, and I have no intention of being distracted. Look, all I'm saying is, if you happen to find yourself talking to your brother, maybe the worst words said between you don't have to be the last one said. Enough! When the day comes to face Freyr again, it will be when I am standing on my feet and free. Do you understand me? <laughs> it will not be while I'm stuck in this preposterous situation. <laughs> Got a case of pride, I guess. <laughs> Hope yours clears up quicker than mine did. A touching story, that was. By your wish. This river, it used to be filled with boats of people visiting from different villages. I've never seen it so empty. What did Odin do to drive everyone away? What weapons did he make the dwarves build him? How much was just Mjolnir? Can one man do this much damage? Depends on the weapon and the man. What'd you find? Sounds shiny. Not now, brother. We've got company. Show me what you got. <laughs> Got another one! 
joins the party? Look alive! Bring it! You can't do anything with that yet, it seems. Hold up! If you want to keep your insides inside, All yours. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. Come on up. Bet you're glad old Brock's around to save you. Uh oh. Shit! We should probably go get him. Keep your guard up. Send another god to do his dirty work. Thor, too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing, then. All right. No, no. No need for threats, brother. I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. He sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me! I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. 
You can undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So, you serve my sister. Oh. Oh. Don't we all? Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that? Rusty hag. Oh, can it, Blubber? Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Freya. Uh, Rock, what do you think you're doing? Hello, servant of Freya. Do not speak to him. Shouldn't we be moving along? Look, you chased him off. Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. Gonna introduce me to this tall glass of milk you got for a bodyguard? Of course I'm gonna. That's Kratos. Oh, you can call him whatever pops into your head. Kratos, Lunda. We go back. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. Something special? Am I good or what? Very good. You won't get so much as a paper cut in that. You won't get so much as a paper cut in that. Get so much as a paper cut in that.
ready when you are. You make up your mind. Now don't go get yourself killed, hear? Sorry we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. I'm pretty used to only seeing Ace here in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face, right? His name is Kratos, and no. The Ace here on Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, uh, I lost count. What is your plan? Still kind of working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. Well, I'll take what I can get. Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. Hey, Kratos. As long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. A bit late for that one, Emma. All right, let's see. Now that the distractions are out of the way. I have words if you would hear them. Speak then. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. You have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors. So by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me. But I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments, and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his... No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about.
An ancient. I know what you're doing. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own. Thanks. Everyone is so eager to advise me. As if any of you know me or what I need. The biggest loss in my life is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family. My mess. I know Falder wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes. I do. <laughs> Before Atreus? Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? It was long ago. Never mind. I shouldn't have asked. Ha! 
Go! Oh. 
We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley, this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back the blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya, but it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace I seek. All those times I found you, why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. You hear that? Noken! And so close to the village! Their song makes their allies invulnerable! They will not let you pass unless you destroy them all! seek with Freyr in the crops. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. It's all so simple. Why did I have to come back here and be reminded of all this? Grand Hall. It's in ruin. May Freya never waver. The other half is missing. May she protect us always. An old adage, if you will. I hear them inside. Get ready to clear them out.
stand. At night, we made our way home, alone, or with food for wolves. That is how Spartans are made. These plants behave similarly to the scorn holes we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. Considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. The 
Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. Disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one Gore concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time, Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Ha! Well done, bro. Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a way to <laughs> the time we're given to spend with them. You never know when someone will come along and cut it short. <laughs> Can you swing that torch to the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path? You can probably use those islands to get a better angle on the torch, no?
swing the torch to the other side. Let's not waste any more time. Come on. Let's cross the bridge now. Anyone alive be squeamish about war. After all the gods you've killed. I have seen enough war to know the cost. And I do. After the price of the Look around you. See what happens when you don't fight a treaty. Alright, now back to the task at hand. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. Oh! <laughs> 
Ragnarok would not bring back what you have lost any more than killing me. I am reaching my limit for enlightened platitudes from you today. Can you please just shut up and kill things? Did it.
tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me, and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. Let's go. It's just past those doors up ahead. I feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. <sighs> Hold on. Something's not right. Opin Bera. <sighs> World Tree Roots. Bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Nepo! The creature! It belongs to Odin? No! It protects Yggdrasil's roots wherever they are. Master was counting on it. Good! He's at it! Go! 
If I free the Vanaheim root, I can help you. I can handle the creature. Focus on the root. I'm trying.
done. It's over. It's, it's really over. And now that you have what you seek, I suppose this is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. Have you decided? I don't think I can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry that it'll always be. It'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. Not for that. My 
I do not regret saving your life, and never will. But the choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice. Now that I am myself again, I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. I mean, 